Hi everyone, so I'm going to do a haul for you today, and I haven't done a haul in a very, very long time, um, so I'm just going to get started. So, first I went to Lush, and um, this bag says Lush Fresh Handmade Colour Emotional Brilliance, I love the bag, and then it says We Second Your Emotions. And what I got from Lush is I got the Honey I Wash the Kids, um, and this was four pounds sixty two for zero point one three six kilograms. Read it. Um, and this smells so nice. It smells of just honey and really sweet, nice things. And I've never actually got this soap before. Um, I've never actually got a soap from Lush. Um, so I just really wanted to try one, and I just love the look of them and things. So, I'm not going to open it for you, um, I'll probably use it tonight, because I'm going to get a shower tonight, um, because, um, because of, um, tomorrow, because it's my first day at high school tomorrow, I'm really, really nervous, um, yeah, so I'm going to use that tonight. So I'll let you know what it looks like in the next video. And then I only got two things. Uh, and then I got the Fizzbanger Bath Ballistic um, for... How much was this? Have a look at the receipt. Sorry, I'm not filming on my iPod today because it takes too long to upload. Um, um, that was three pounds twenty-two. So I'll open it for you. Um, Quite a big bath plastic. Just looks like that. Um, and most of them were kind of like cracked, and you could see the middle of them. But what this does, the reason why it's called the fizz banger, is because it's so when you put it in, it kind of fizz bangs everywhere, and um, like fizzes everywhere. But then as it gets down to the middle, like when it starts, you know, dissolving, it gets to different colours, like blues and greens and stuff in the middle. And I just thought that'd be so cool. And it smells so nice and fresh and strong. I just love Lush. Like, I could spend a whole day in Lush looking at everything. But unfortunately, I didn't have that much time. Um because we that was like the first shop we went to so yeah so we needed to get around all the other shops as well so yeah so I only got two things from there because I'm not being funny but Lush is quite pricey so um, and we don't have like Bath and Body Works over here we don't have that many soap shops over here um, and in America they have Bath and Body Works and I don't know what else. Um Bellamy. Then I went to Paper Chase and the bag is just so cool. I just like the writing. And I got a school bag and this look at this. It is just so cute and pretty. Um and it's got like birds. 
in like it's got butterflies and flowers and stuff like that so it's two like fake buckles here um, and it's buttons and then inside it has this which is tied together at the moment but it's a long strap um, and it stinks of fish in here because of the ink that they've used but I'm going to spray it out and inside it has a phone Oh. It has a phone holder and then a little pocket here, and then that's inside. You see that? Um, and it's just printed with like some leaves, and then it has a zip pocket here. He took the stuffing out because it was like a big box inside it, and then it just and then it has a pocket in the front as well. Um. So yeah, I just love the bag. Um, this video is going to be long, so yeah. And this was £25. I know it's pricey, but it's a nice bag. So that's the whole bag, and it's really soft leather it's just really nice and then the next thing I only got two things from paper chase the next thing I got from paper chase was a pencil case I just thought this was such a cute pencil case I need a big pencil case like this is a pretty big pencil case as stuff um but yeah that's a pretty big pencil case you can see it inside um and I really like it because the pattern is just like kind of vintage. Like you can see, it has like yeah stuff like that. And then it's leather on the top. It's like brown leather, and it's a gold zip with a leather. Is the leather zip here? I just thought that was so nice. Um, my old pencil case is this one which yes it has an ink stain on it and I just couldn't go in with that and have so much stuff so I definitely needed a big pencil case so yeah and this pencil case was five pounds I just love it I love these two things and I thought they kind of matched because they're both kind of like vintagey it's gonna take ages Oh, I'm gonna shiver it now. Then I got this from New York. I didn't go to New York. My mum's boyfriend's mum went to New York. They got back last night, I think, or the middle of the night. And they got me a present, which I thought was so cool. Oh, and they gave me this notebook. She didn't buy this, this was just in their house, but she gave me this notebook for tomorrow. Um, and it's by Recycled Notebooks, and it has this look. Look how cute it is. And then in the front it says 10 Good Reasons to Recycle, which I probably won't be reading, and then it just has lined paper there. But anyway, they went to New they went to New York and they went to M and M's World and apparently they had absolutely loads. So they got me this look at that. M and M's World and it's a flower box. That's what it's called. And it was eight dollars ninety five. I'm reading it off the pack. But look how cute that is. And it's two because um, one for me and one for my mum's boyfriend's daughter who lives in Scotland so I'll have to give it to her um, next, next time she comes down which is probably going to be like October time. So I just love that. I think it's so cute. And then I went to BHS. 
I don't usually go to the HS, but I got this school skirt because I said I'm going back to school tomorrow. I need this. So I got a skirt and it's you can't see it, it just looks like black, but it's pleated at the bottom. No, you can't see, it's not gonna show up, but this was thirteen pounds. Yeah, it's thirteen pounds. Has a zip there. And it's really good. And the school I'm going to, I'm not obviously gonna say it, but the school I'm going to say that you have to have it at the knee. Stupid rules. But you know. That's the rule. Um oh forgot to show you. I got all my uniform today from the school. So these are the PE shorts. The boys and the girls wear the same. But this it's Nike. So yeah. Like that. Then got PE socks which just go like really long PE socks. Um, I got, oh no, there's the logo on it. I'm just covering up the logo of my school, because then you'll know where I am. Um, but this is a polo shirt for PE. Um, I've got my tie, which is a clip-on tie. Yeah, it's a clip-on tie. Um, to avoid, you know, so you just all look the same. And it's really thin, it just looks awful. And it's green with red stripes. Um, yeah. So, that. No. Shin pads. And no. then. My school jumper, which is a plain black jumper, which is a plain black jumper, and yeah, I won't show you the logo because then obviously you'll know what school I go to. So yeah. So, that's it, that's my haul, um, and next month I'm actually going shopping with my mum and we're going to get even more stuff, so there'll be a haul next month as well, which will be October, yes. So a lot is happening recently and I'm going back to school tomorrow, which is my first ever day at high school. I'm really super nervous, really nervous. But anyways, I'll get through it. So thank you for watching this video. My next video won't be tomorrow. Um, it'll probably be sometime this week or next week because I'll be really busy this week. So thank you for watching. Bye! Oh, wait, and all my uniform was £47 altogether, which is a lot. So thank you for watching. Bye.